So what I love about North is that we have an incredible community. So that community starts with our students and our student body, which is one of the most diverse in the entire district. And as a part of that, we have students who come from all sorts of life backgrounds, but they all come here and they engage with each other, or they interact with each other, and ultimately they build relationships across lines of difference, which I think is incredibly important in our global society. From the community components to the active engagement that we have, to the academics that take place for our students, we have students who are able to reach their dreams once they graduate. And we're preparing all of our students to be career and college ready. Uh, we are one of the only schools that have a full-time college advisor as well as a full-time career advisor. We just want to recognize that North High School has come from a place where just back in 2008, we had just over 700 students. And now we have over 1,500 students. But I share that because that small school feel and the intentionality that we have with each student has not gotten lost as we've doubled in size, which is a true testament to this community and to the work that we're doing at North High School. So you have probably seen our school from a spear or from the outside, and you know that it's a beautiful historic building. However, it's just as beautiful in the inside. The atmosphere feels really light, wonderful, and friendly. The classrooms are set up in a way that makes the students and teachers feel comfortable. The building is super well maintained by both our staff and students, and we always find a lot of joy by just going through the doors and being in awe of how beautiful the building is. If you're thinking about coming to North, I say just do it because it's an amazing school and it's probably the best decision I've made because I think, I think that high school, choosing what high school you go to is what impacts your like, future the most and if you choose North, that would be good and positive. You need to come and, and see what it feels like, how our hallways are quiet and yet our classrooms buzz. You need to come and feel the passion and hard work of everyone, students and staff in this building. I love being a part of North High School and its long and rich history. Go Vikings! The community in North High School is very supportive. Uh, we, we work together uh, on so many different initiatives to, to make North High School a great place for students and for the community. Uh, there's a tremendous alumni here at North High School. We've been around for over 100 years and there's a deep passion for, for Vikings and, and the support is fantastic. The culture is extremely positive. Uh, the staff climate is extremely positive and this is a great place to, to work and, and that's why I've been here for over 10 years. If you are choosing a school, you would be hard pressed to find a school that is as supportive, as tailored to you, as accepting as North. We really will um, take every effort to get to know you as an individual, design your schedule so that it fits you, pair you with teachers and peers that will reflect who you are, challenge you, support you. Uh, I think the North High community is really truly a family that supports one another, challenges one another, and is so accepting. One thing that I really admire about the kids is they um, come together, they're super friendly and welcoming to each other. Um, it's totally different from what I experienced when I was in high school. As an adult, I've just noticed kids being very welcoming no matter who you are or where you come from. I really love coming to work each day. There is such a a buzz and an energy about this school. As soon as I walk through the front doors, I'm greeted by students and staff, and as I walk to my classroom, the halls are filled with students, and they're excited to be there, and they're excited to see me, and I'm happy to see them. In, in relation to, to just North High School um, as a whole, I think I've said it before, it just is a, is a special feeling and it's so cool to see people come back um, and really be supportive. I mean, not just people who just, just recently graduated, but people who graduated 10, 20, 30, 40 years ago. I'm just really privileged and honored uh, to be a part of, of what's going on here at North and, and being a part of, of the continued success that we have here. Uh, the culture at North High School is really, really strong. I've noticed students just have each other's back and there's like a huge culture of an investigation and students ask questions, they want to learn more, they're really excited about the programming and they have so many different opportunities here which is really awesome. If I'm a new student coming into North, I know that I'm going to be welcomed. 
I know that I'm going to be cared for. I know that they're going to express love and compassion and that my teachers are going to listen to me and that my voice will be heard. So if I'm that parent and I'm thinking about different schools in the area, North is my go-to. Athletics, academics, community, it's all there. Um, being here at North and in the, in the Western community um, is probably one of the best things here in Denver. Uh, honestly, the admin, the staff, the faculty, and the students are some of the best I've experienced so far. Uh, not only in just Colorado, but in DPS as compared to anywhere else I've been, and it's just been one of the best and positive experiences I've had, uh, me being a first-year teacher here at North. If you're looking for tradition, and if you're looking to build on a continuing legacy, uh, North High School is the place to be. It's one of the oldest schools in Denver, um, and it's such an exciting opportunity to add to uh, the traditions and legacy that we've already established here. So if you're an 8th grader or a 9th, 10th, 11th grader who's looking to attend high school or attend a different school, uh, North should be the place for you. So uh, a few things as to why North is that place. Uh, so first of all, North High School is a place where we not only value diversity, but we want to create a sense of belonging for every single student. And so what this looks like are simple things where we have pictures of every single student around the building to show that we are family and community, to the welcome and greeting of students when they come into the building uh, with music and to celebrate each individual, to the care that each of our teachers show for all of our students. So if you're looking for a place that's gonna challenge you, if you look, you're looking for a place where you're gonna have fun, and ultimately a place where you are gonna belong as an individual, we want North to be that place, and we believe that North can be that place for you. I think one of the really great things about our academics here at North are that we take a really holistic approach to uh, what we are um, enrolling your student in. For example, uh, if you're a ninth grader interested and ready for college level classes, we offer two college level classes to our ninth graders. So we really focus on making sure your student is um, adequately challenged as well as adequately supported. Academics at North High School is really outstanding and achieving. My favorite subject in school is English. I love that subject because I get to connect with different um, authors, different genres. Um, you can write different things. You can um, see different things. You can connect to different texts. You can. There's so much you can do um, with reading. It really builds that background knowledge, that knowledge that you have to make you strong as a reader. This is the best teaching staff that I have ever worked with at any of the other high schools. This is my third high school at DPS and I feel like our teaching staff um, really cares about the students. They care about making classes fun and relevant to your student. And one thing that we offer that um, wasn't offered at some of our other high schools was um, office hours twice a week and sometimes I offer them four days a week just because uh, kids are really eager to learn and um, they like that one-on-one -on -one time with their teachers. As both an engineering teacher and also a special education teacher I get the really cool experience of both teaching an elective course um, as well as being pushing into a math course and so I see the really strong academic aspects of North High School and how much rigor there is in all of our coursework while still being engaging for students and the wealth of different kinds of courses and different kind of offerings here is really, really incredible. The special education team here at North High School is awesome. Um, the, there's so many different kind of support systems here at North, which is really, really cool and offering students the opportunities to connect to life after high school and really, really experience other things. Some of my favorite things at North is the opportunities given, such as in the academics, there's different education levels for the students, such as AP, honors, and regular classes. And another opportunity are the different electives given. There's like in the arts, the athletics, which is really nice too. This is the place to be. And if you're serious about 
um, academics and athletics, this is the place to be. Um, so what I love most about teaching at North is it just truly feels like you're part of a big family. In my role as a special education teacher at North, I primarily work with English teachers. Um, so this year I am supporting Jenna Hughes's English 2 classroom. So I'm in there with her working with students that um, have exceptionalities um, related to literacy, but I also am in there just supporting any students that need extra support. Some of the things I like being about a North Viking is all the courses that they have to offer here at North. Like for example, I have Chinese broadcasting journalism and also Latinos in Action. I think Latinos in Action is like about culture, so it's like really cool that they have that course. Teaching at North is really wonderful because we always think about the student first. It is a school oriented towards making sure that students are humans who are here to learn and develop their interests. So we make sure that our education is tailored and, um, and really, really involves the student voice and the student's interest. So that can be a lot of fun, but also really exciting for both the students and teachers. So what I love about social and emotional supports at North is that there are so many people dedicated to offering those supports and that they're very experienced and competent and warm. There's preventative programming like signs of suicide. We do the best screener, which screens all students for social emotional concerns. Um, if they're experiencing elevated stress, anxiety, depression, we offer individual therapy. And my job as a lead really revolves around that because we have the school-based health center. We have two full-time therapists through that program, through Denver Health. We also have several partner providers through Maria Droz Counseling Center, the office at North. We also offer groups for trauma, grief, uh, loss, anxiety. Just, we really are at North dedicated to putting our money where our mouth is in terms of offering social emotional support to comprehensively help the whole child aspect really, really kick in because we understand that our students can access academics successfully if those lower levels of basic needs for belonging and safety are met. So as a part of our community at North, we are a restorative practice school. So what that means is that when we have conflict, because we will always have conflict, uh, we are going to work to build the skill to resolve that conflict in the moment and hopefully in the future where we're able to uh, handle that conflict in different ways. And I share that because I think it's really important that here at North we have that loving and caring cushion of support for all of our students where we're going to ask questions, where we're going to really seek to understand, and we're going to make sure that we listen to students and their student voice. And so within that restorative practice that means that we're going to dialogue that we're going to hear the perspective of others and we're going to learn uh, about difference as we solve our conflicts as a part of that student voice becomes really really critical and our student leadership to our clubs and activities uh, plays a role in that restorative practice culture because the more that our students are engaged and get to know one another uh, when you see somebody, when you get to know who they are as a person in their heart, like that really allows you to work with them and creates a culture where people really want to be. And so I share that because here at North, it's really, really critical to us that everybody who walks into this building knows that they're going to be safe, knows they're going to be cared for, and knows that it's a place where we want that student to be. At North, we have five school counselors. We also have two college advisors in our Future Center, which is located in our library. The school counselors at North provide services in the areas of academic, social-emotional, and career development. 
We implement these services through individual, group, and classroom activities while collaborating with parents, staff, students, and community members to ensure equity, access, and success for all of our Vikings. So something important to realize about North High School is that even though it is a very strong and rigorous academic school, we think about our students as a whole child. And that is not just a phrase, we really do think that the students' mental health, the students' social emotional learning, and that the students' personal needs are just as important as what they are learning in their classes. North High School is extremely um, honored to have and lucky to have a City Year team supporting our students each year. City Year is an AmeriCorps program that places young people into urban schools and communities as um, near peer mentors. So working with students, not as teachers, but as um, just an extra support in the classroom, as well as um, providing socio-emotional support um, and extracurricular activities. And we really put some effort into getting to know our students first. We know all of our students by name and last name and their own story before we tell them what they need to do for them to get to know themselves. What stands out about our counseling program at North is that our department was recognized by the American School Counseling Association as being a model counseling program. Only a few high schools in the state of Colorado have been given that award and, and we are quite proud of that. At North, the whole child is really, really critical. So we're focused on the academic outcomes and also the personal success of all of our students. As a part of that, we have a robust elective program that runs from world language to visual arts, to performing arts, to JROTC, engineering, computer science. And so across all of our electives, we wanna make sure that we're meeting the needs of our students. We're the only school that offers a freshman seminar, a health and wellness trajectory. So the first year as a ninth grader, the majority of our ninth graders get a foundation for just what high school is like, having conversations and learning about race, class, and privilege, while also getting to understand themselves and making healthy, safe choices so that they can build the habits and skills as they become adults. In addition, we allow our students to choose for the remainder of their time uh, three electives. So they take their four classes, but then they have three electives. And we have elective pathways where our hope is that all of our students, by the time they are finished with their electives, have either earned college credit through taking AP advanced placement classes, or they've taken college classes to earn college credit through those elective pathways. Our elective teachers are dedicated to their work, and here at North, we don't value our math class or our English class more than an elective class like a drawing class or ceramics or a choir class. We see them all as equally important as we build out the whole child. We have offerings that are your typical ensembles like choir, band, and orchestra, and we have really great ensembles led by my two colleagues, John Jonas and Ali Olson in those three categories. Uh, but we also have a really wide variety of other music classes that students can take, and we have cultivated those and grown the program over the course of the last several years. Students can take, as I mentioned, guitar class and piano class to learn um, new skills on those instruments if they like. They can also take modern band where they learn instruments like the electric guitar, the electric bass, the drum set, and they form bands and play together to write songs and play covers of songs that they already know. We also have two levels of audio production where students get to work with software to create beats and songs uh, in the style of music that many of them really love and enjoy. We also have a mariachi class uh, for students. We have a lot of students who come from a background that includes mariachi, and so we're really glad to be bringing that back. We have a great drum line, which has been a staple at North for many, many years, and so we're also glad to have that. Um, when I was a freshman at North last year, um, coming to North, I was really excited about the drama program. And when I started out in the musical, that was a really nice opportunity because there's a lot of kids that do the musical, boys and girls. 
and it's really opening and you even if you're not good at singing or dancing or acting it's still a good thing you can do because Gil lets you in and it's also a learning experience which is really nice. We have courses all the way from drawing and painting to ceramics to sculpture all the way up to AP art and design. We also have our digital program with digital design and photography where they're using the latest computer programs and technology. Our theater program is also one of the best in DPS. They put on excellent pro productions with a new musical every year and plays in the fall. So in JROTC, there's lots of opportunities that you get and you're also able to meet so many different types of people. I know for me personally, I've made a lot of friends in this program that I might not have met outside of JROTC. I've also been able to get all of my community service hours that I need to graduate completely finished through all the things that I've done in this program. JROTC offers lots of extracurricular opportunities as well, including Color Guard, Raider, Drill, and more. There's lots more than that. And on these teams, you're able to gain lots of important life skills and also just meet so many different types of people and have a great time. I don't think PE at North has uh, been better. Uh, we have Fit One, Advanced Strength, Swim One, Swim Two, Team Life. So you can pretty much do a whole gamut of different styles of physical education. Um, and it's wonderful. Again, we have that new, brand new weight room for our fitness classes. We have a ton of equipment for yoga, Pilates, uh, your standard strength training. We have two auxiliary gyms um, just to add extra space so our PE classes aren't so cramped. Um, and then our pool. We're one of the only schools in the district with a pool. So we offer that to our kids and it's a, a great outlet for them. Hi, I'm Cadet First Lieutenant Emilio Carrasco. Um, just gonna talk about ROTC. I think it's a great thing. They, uh, they motivate me to be a better citizen every day. It's, it's like a, a leadership class, really. It's, we just get in there every day and we learn more about life and everything from finances to academics to colleges, scholarships, all that stuff. They really just help us improve in our day to day. I believe we have one of the best teams in DPS. Um, although there are some other fabulous art teachers out there, but I love the team that I work with very much. I love working with my students, helping to build their confidence in art and build their skills in art. So we love to cultivate that creativity and that joy with our students and see them engage with music. I'm so happy to be a North Viking. So being a student athlete at North, uh, it takes a tremendous amount of balancing. Uh, there's uh, your academics that come first, uh, there's family commitments, there's sports practices, and so part of being a high school athlete is learning those time management skills. Uh, we expect our student athletes to be model students in the hallways, in the classroom, and, and a model citizen in the community. We are running 750 student athletes currently in 21 different sports. Um, many of those students are two sport and three sport athletes, um, but that does take uh, support from the family and it takes uh, a tremendous amount of time management skills to be a, a, to be a three sport athlete. Um, and we do the best that we can at North High School to support each of our students that want to do whatever it is that they want to do. So last year I was a freshman and I made the girls varsity soccer team and I got Coach Porter his first year as a girls coach. Once you made the team, he actually had a sleep in school for a team bonding experience. So then we all really knew each other and felt comfortable around each other. So it really felt like a team. Everything has improved at North since I've been here. Uh, facilities, uh, the quality of student-athlete, 
Um, the coaching, everything has improved since I've been here. North hadn't had a winning season when I got here in over 20 years. And um, by year three, we had a winning season. By year five, we were 16 and two. Um, by year eight, uh, we were playing in a state championship game. We have had multiple athletes go on to play in college. We've had players play for the under 23 Rapids. We've had players go on trial in Europe. I was just hired this last year as the girls coach. We were really excited about the future of the girls team. Uh, we trained all summer, all winter. So I think the future of the girls program is outstanding. Um, it could pass the boys program honestly in the future. Yeah, what I love about coaching tennis is I really love the kids. Uh, they're just so much fun to see outside of the classroom. It's great to develop a relationship with them on the court and then see them working in the classroom. We can kind of leverage those and, and put both those relationships together. One thing I'm most proud of uh, in my time here at North uh, High School as the head football coach is just the amount of kids that we put to go play college football. Um, I think it's been a pretty big accomplishment in the last Two, the last two seasons, we've sent seven kids uh, to go play college football. Um, and I think that's just been a huge accomplishment from different to, uh, different schools, from NAIA to Division Three uh, to Division II. Um, and I just think that's really cool to see these kids aren't only pursuing their, their academic careers, but they're pursuing their football careers, which for some kids, it doesn't really, it, it stops at high school. Um, one of the greatest things I think about being a part of this, of this school and this program, for me personally as a football coach, is our homecoming. Uh, games when you have the giant bonfire going and there's a, hundreds of people surrounding it when you're driving down 32nd um, and everyone is cheering for you yelling and screaming the kids are excited um, the cars are rolling through uh, it's just a really cool feeling and it's something I've never been a part of and it's something that I'm so appreciative um, and honored that I can be a part of as well our baseball program here at North in my opinion is, is one of the best in the state in regards to um, work ethic environment accountability etc send multiple kids to the next level and, uh, we're serious about baseball here at north high school uh, not only with our athletic field but our indoor facility and in, in the classroom as well it's very cool to be able to introduce this sport and kind of watch my players learn and grow um, again not just as students or players but as young people during the winter, our off-season program, we had 30 to 40 kids every single day um, working on their off-season goals. It was awesome. And then we had 60 students come out for our spring program and we were ready to roll. Um, we're still carrying a lot of that momentum through the summer and uh, looking forward to heading out there in the spring if we can and continuing our progress. I think what makes a great uh, Viking student athlete would be commitment to both sports and academics. You can't have one without the other and I find uh, our students that are committed to uh, doing things on the court and off the court find the most success. To be a successful student athlete you have to be fully engaged in being a student first. There's weekly eligibility reports, uh, coaches are always keeping track of kids' grades. So um, academics is number one. Uh, as far as the team goes, uh, it's a family unit at this point, it really is. The other thing um, that we really tried to do is teach the kids to be about their community and to be a team and to be about more than themselves. Uh, I think the game of football, you have to be selfless in order to be successful. I think the thing about North is you're gonna get a quality education. So you come to North, you're gonna have plenty of opportunities to take higher level classes, AP, honors, college classes, um, get college credit while you're still in high school, scholarship opportunities. I think the big thing is, you know, if a kid wants to come here and get a quality education, they're gonna get that. Now, now on top of that education, they're going to have a high level of athletics too. What is there not to love about girls basketball? Um, I love the atmosphere, I love the excitement and um, friendships um, and long, la long lasting bonds that it uh, generates. Um, the opportunities that the girls have to play basketball, to travel, to see different things, to experience new things and meet new people. Um, I think uh, girls basketball provi provides a lot of opportunities to do those things. No other high school has had Steph Curry play a version of horse with their basketball team. 
Our numbers are growing. Um, and I think if you just want to be a part of something special and you want to be that guy to take the sport that you play to the next level, coming to North High School is the place to be. So the Alumni Association here at North High School um, had early beginnings in the 1880s when North High School originally opened up in Ashland Elementary School on the third floor. But quickly after um, our first graduating class matriculated on to life, uh, the Alumni Association kind of went defunct. And then a group of very committed individuals in the late 1980s refounded the Alumni Association and has been active in Denver, North Denver, and supporting North High School students ever since. Wally Ginn came up with an idea that we should send a scholar to college, support a scholar in college, and we did. The class of 1937 gave the Alumni Association $500, which we promptly gave away, and that started the Alumni Scholarship Foundation. From that $500 in the last 26 years, we have grown to $1,200,000 uh, in corpus, and we are giving $80,000 in scholarships. And last year we gave 34 scholarships to students at North High School. The North High School Alumni Association has a scholarship foundation, an endowment of over $1 million and that money just goes to North High School students to help them uh, pursue their future. And so it's in the stories where students are able to do things in life, specifically go to college, but that they otherwise wouldn't be able to do because of the financial resources or because of the opportunities that they uh, may not have had at other schools, where they're able to then really succeed and to be a leader. As an alum, it, it means the world to me to see where the school is now, to essentially be proving people wrong and showing um, that you can be successful after you leave North uh, is, is awesome. And just to see all the great things that are happening here um, is, means the world to me and my family. We have over 20 volunteers who contribute their time to service on our board of directors. Um, and in terms of our alumni association and our space inside North High School, our alumni center, we have a core dedicated group of about 10 folks who maintain archives, who collect our historical memorabilia, which include trophies and other awards that Denver North High School has received throughout the years. What it means is we are connecting to our past and by preserving our history, moving us into the future, giving our kids the best opportunity to grow into a larger world and be successful.